Namaste. Welcome to sisrekhaskitchen.com. Today I am going to show you how to make your own air freshener with essential oils. Commercial air fresheners contain toxic and hazardous chemicals. The most common air fresheners are scented candles, aerosols, electric air fresheners and oil diffusers. And the most common chemicals in the air fresheners are formaldehyde, benzene and toluene. Those hazardous chemicals may cause damage to your lungs, brain, central nervous system and immune system. It may be okay if you use them just once in a while but regular usage may not be good for your kids and your pets. And some people don't even open the doors and windows for fresh air. Then the chemicals will build up inside the house and you will be inhaling them constantly. And who knows, they are the ones triggering your migraines or asthma attacks. On the other hand, essential oils are soothing and healing. You may use any of your favorite essential oils like lavender, citrus oils, eucalyptus, tea tree oil, clove oil, sandalwood or cedarwood oils. So let's make it. I have taken about 1 cup of distilled water in a spray bottle. If you don't have distilled water, you can use the purest water that you can get. I am going to use sandalwood oil and eucalyptus essential oils. You can use just one kind of oil or combinations. Simply add the essential oils to the water. I am using about 8 to 10 drops of eucalyptus oil and 8 to 10 drops of sandalwood essential oil. Be careful while handling the essential oils because you may get irritation on your eyes or skin. Put the cap to the spray bottle and shake it well. Every time shake it once before you use. Whenever you ran out you can just make it again quickly. And we know the ingredients exactly. You can spray it on the furniture curtains, in the bathroom, the bedroom, living room, etc. But do not overuse it. The best air freshener in the world is to open the doors and let the fresh air come in. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please give me your feedback. For more healthy recipes and DIYs, check out my website at sisrekaskitchen.com. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and like my Facebook page.